So this might have been something that's happened to you. The snowstorm arrives, right? And then your mailbox gets knocked down by the plow. 22 News reporter Kate Wilkinson is live from our Franklin County Bureau in Greenfield tonight. And Kate, what happens next? Really, there isn't a simple answer here, is there? What happens next depends on where you live, but a good way to start is to check in with your local highway district office. Now here in Greenfield, the deputy director of the Department of Public Works, uh, Paul Newell, said that you should call the city. An assessor would be sent out, and if it was in fact the plower's fault, the city would fix it. But if you're looking to avoid this scenario altogether, Newell said that you should start by checking if your mailbox is mounted at least eight inches from the curb and is 46 inches from the ground up. I would recommend doing a uh, fall check of the actual mailbox itself, the, the post, to make sure everything is still structurally good, make sure there's no rot, make sure that it's in the ground approximately two feet to support the mailbox. What kind of mailbox you have also matters. A wooden or metal post is what Newell recommends. Plastic mailboxes, however, he does not recommend, and that's because plastic can be more susceptible to the cold. Working for you live from the Franklin County Bureau in Greenfield, Kate Wilkinson, 22 News.